Hello, beautiful people. Welcome to my channel. My name is Sandra Costina, and I love animals. You have already known. So today we're going to do something very, very fun, which is I'm going to let four of my terrapins free roam, and they're all inside this bucket here because I just pulled them out of the tank, and they're not really happy. <laughs> So I am quickly going to dry them up and let them free roam around my dance studio. So, um, I've had a lot of questions like, you know, can you actually tell the difference between them and stuff like that? So yes, I can and I'm going to show you how before I let them free roam. So I've got four of them, Faith, Hope, Love and Charity. So I'm going to quickly show you, okay. so. The first one I have here is Hope. <laughs> okay, Hope is like a massive scratcher because she scratches me so much. But if you can see her shell, so they're all girls. You can see her shell, she has a little bit of a contour going on in the middle here. Um, but in terms of size, she's hissing. In terms of size, she is actually like two hand size. So yes. So usually how I hold terrapins would be one hand at the bottom, one hand at the top so they don't get to scratch you. So this is just something that I got along the way from them scratching me a lot. So yes. So the towel here is just to dry them because I just pulled them out of their tank. So here it's Hope. Say hi everyone. So this is Hope. Okay. So yes. Uh, let me just dry her. So the next one I have would be Faith. <laughs> so Faith is the smallest red ear slider that I have. So if you can see her shell wise, she is um, not so big about a hand, a hand size. Um, she has slightly greener eyes, that's how I identify her. But of course in size, you know, she's a lot smaller so it's a lot, ouch, a lot easier to identify her so yes she's my little baby she's also the one in our other video that was um uh had a swollen eye for about two months and we we're taking care of her so yes this is Faith. she has grown a lot since that video if you see it the previous time that was really small so this is Faith. maybe i'm gonna let her go here you go Faith. all right next i have charity so Charity is our biggest red ear slider. Let me just grab her. She's so heavy. So this is Charity. She is our biggest red ear slider. So if you can see, okay, she is about two half hands. I'm just gonna quickly dry her. She is darker in shade, um, but she's she's always the one eating the most. So yeah, she is so big. But look at her face. She's so cute. Charity, say hi. Hello. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna put her down. So yes. Wipey, wipey, wipe. Oh, okay. So I've just got a scratch. You can see. There's blood. But yes, this is quite common because their nails are actually quite sharp. Um, it's not painful, it's just a small scratch. So their nails are actually quite sharp, but you cannot cut their nails. And because they are all girls, their nails are actually shorter. So it's not that long, so it's still okay. So male red ear sliders have like really long nails, so those could be painful as well. Okay, last one I have. Love! Dripping water. <laughs> okay, so love is the last red ear slider. Her shell shape is actually a lot rounder. And she's uh, actually a lighter green as compared to the rest, so that's how I usually um, identify her but you know um, she has opened up a lot she used to be really shy but she opened up a lot now and she's eating a lot better so I really really love that about her and yeah so this is how she looks she's so pretty baby so this is love hi darling so yes Love, love. Okay, love can go now. Be dry, can go. So, while they are all, you know, crawling around, I adopted all four of them. Um, 
they were bought in Singapore at a pet shop at like four for ten dollars. Hope's gonna shift the camera. <laughs> yeah, they were bought at a pet shop for four for ten dollars, Singapore dollars, and I think in US it's about four for seven US dollars, which is actually too dirt cheap. Because people don't realize that terrapins live a really, really long life. And you know, for something that was so small, and she was only like this small, like like this, like maybe one sixth of her shell size or even smaller. And now she's already this size and Faith is already the smallest, so you can imagine like, you know, how much how much work there is for all of them. So yeah. It really takes um a lot to take care of them. Uh, I'll put them back into their tank later so you can see, but yes. Let's kind of go follow them around the dance studio <laughs> because this is kind of what free roaming for terrapins looks like and good luck to me catching them. So yes, let's go follow them. We have Charity. Hi Charity. <laughs> I'm Charity. Hello darling. And then we have Love right under the sofa. And then we have Hope over here. Hi, Poppy. Poppy, you want to say hi, Hope? Oh, no? Okay. And then we have Faith here. Look at herself in the mirror. Pretty girl, hi. <laughs> She's so cute. So they are all just running around. Yay! Two little ones. So if you can see, um, the top of the shells, um, they are actually shedding a little bit. Um, they've been basking quite a bit, so all four of them have the white spots on the shell. And um, if you can see on Hope's shell, there's a little bit of algae, so that makes a little bit of a scrub. But it's actually not so bad today. But yeah, I do need to scrub that with a toothbrush. And then, yeah, for all of them, they are very, very independent by the way. And they live for 20, 30, 40 years in captivity. So you can imagine, you know, how much work and how much love you have to pour in for them for their life. So, not forget them. Oh my god. Here's the turtle. So, it's like my fifth turtle. I've got a fifth turtle over here. Yeah, you guys are coming to the turtle? You guys coming to the turtle? They're all like calling to, to, to me. Hi. Hello. Hello. You want to see the turtle? Turtle. Mm -hmm. So, if you see what they are trying to do, is they're actually trying to find some place to hide. Um, they are good hiders, so when they feel a bit unsure or scared, they would try to hide. Look at Faith calling in there. I'm gonna pull her out. So they will try to hide. So yes, let me just put Mr. Turtle back and grab Faith out. Faith. Ah, okay. Put the camera down so I can grab her. Faith. Oh. Back here. Ta-da! So, if you ever ever lose your terrapins or if they run away from their enclosure, always remember they like to hide in small spaces. So you can see she has like some dust in her eyes. I'm gonna, okay, okay. I'm gonna gently remove it. See if I can remove it. I'm not gonna put my hand near their mouth because you know they, they might snap. So, yeah. Hello, Charity. So this is Charity, she's so heavy, she's a big girl. I'm waiting for her to start to lay eggs soon. So yes, this is what's going on with her, she's so heavy. I always have to use two hands to carry her. <laughs> okay, go girl. Where do you guys want to go? Shopping? I want the girl to go shopping. Shopping, shopping. Where are you going, Hope? Where are you going, Hope? Help me, help me, help me, help me, help me. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
Now that I have got all of them back in the bucket, let's go put them back into the enclosure <sighs> so that they can be back in the water. Oh, that was tough. Okay, let's go back girls. Let's go back home. They don't look very happy. Video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and remember a dog don't shop. Okay, so many animals need a home, so please adopt the little ones. Alright, till next time, see ya! Bye!